The Bimini Road, sometimes called the Bimini Wall, is an underwater rock formation near North Bimini Island within the Bahamas. This ancient formation has caused a number of heated debates between academically funded scientific individuals and keen self-funded enthusiasts. The road is nearly a kilometer long and is composed of rectangular limestone blocks. Dr. Eugene Shin, who was originally tasked with investigating the wall, initially found and conveyed compelling details discovered during his dives. The problem, however, just like the many other currently inexplicable artifacts we often share on our channel, if this wall was ever officially confirmed as indeed artificial, it would contradict currently attested theories regarding the timeline of advanced human civilization. The fact that sea levels submerged the wall over 10,000 years ago, a geologically undeniability, means that if it was ever academically authenticated as man-made, it would directly contradict that already supposedly established. Therefore, predictably, after Shin's initial funded research was concluded, he changed data to make it appear as though he had merely displaced there by humans. Greg Little, it seems, has encountered that which we continue to fight on a daily basis. Quote, All contradictions to their beliefs are probably perceived as a direct threat to them professionally and psychologically. The long history of science has countless examples of widely held beliefs that were proven wrong by research. But even in the face of incontrovertible proof that these beliefs were wrong, Many so-called scientists refused to accept the new evidence." End quote. In his introduction, within his detailed analysis of the site, and indeed the academic fallacies therein, he states, quote, In 1968, a 1,600-foot-long J-shaped formation of stone blocks was reportedly discovered about one mile off the west coast of North Bimini by a Miami-based biologist, Dr. J. Manson Valentine. The formation was initially thought to resemble a collapsed wall or a road. Media coverage speculated that the site was associated with Atlantis, and sensationalized reports about the formation were widely disseminated. Shortly thereafter, four geologists asserted that the formation was nothing but natural limestone. Most archaeologists and geologists have accepted the four geologists' claims without question. However, an inspection of the site shows that the skeptics' most important claims about the formation are inaccurate, and other well-known archaeologists appear to have participated in the hoax as co-authors. Paradoxically, these co-authors alleged in several articles that a hoax had been perpetrated at Bimini by others. It is demonstrated herein that USGS geologist Eugene Shin and archaeologist Marshall McCusick published a series of articles wherein they presented false and misleading. End quote. It is a reality we regularly encounter, yet thankfully, one, more and more people are beginning to become aware of. We implore you to read his research. A link is added in the description. Who built the Bimini Road over 10,000 years ago? How did they build it? Where does it lead? It is undoubtedly highly compelling.